Hi, I'm Jarit Sabais. I'm a business coach and I help women entrepreneurs in the early stages of their service base and coaching business increase their productivity, systemize processes so they reduce their stress, create more freedom and generate more profits. And today I want to um, talk about my, my secret to get more done in seven steps. So my first secret is knowing your productivity type. That will help you uh, prioritize your, um, your work for the day. To give you an example, I'm a, I'm a planner, I'm a prioritizer, and um, I know my strengths, uh, work style, and, creates, and I create systems around that. For example, I'm a morning person, and um, I work on the things that need um, high concentration, a lot of focus in the mornings. And then I leave those for um, that obviously uh, don't need so much effort and they and not so much and lower concentration for the as afternoon. But because I'm a planner and prioritize, I like to prioritize all the strong stuff, just to say it like that, um, for the mornings. My second secret will be to use the Pomodoro technique um, to work in blocks of time of 25 minutes and then taking short breaks after every 25 minutes or five minutes, six, you know, five to 10 minutes uh, after each work block. In my case, I use 25, I stop for five minutes and then go back. And then after four um, work uh, blocks of 25 minutes, I take like 15 minute break. And uh, that has helped me a lot to stay focused. And so by, by that, as a result, I, I tend to obviously get more done. So my third secret is to have, um, make my calendar my best friend. Uh, I schedule everything from work periods for, um, for business development, time with clients, and personal time. And although I say personal time at, at last, it's the first thing I schedule. And it should always be the first, the, the first thing um, you, you schedule. Uh, that personal time could be um, working out, reading, meditating, journaling, if that what you know you need. Or it's, you know, it also can be spending time with your partner, with your children, with family. Any activity that you you know that is personal is scheduled first, and obviously it has to be around your lifestyle. And also you could do that daily, weekly. You can always revise it. Nothing is written in stone. So schedule first your, you know, your personal time and then do your blocks of work, okay? Um, the reason I emphasize to um, uh, schedule everything is because in, we live we lead very busy life, and in my case, if I don't schedule it, I forget it. So, appointments, everything, I schedule it, friend, uh, meeting with friends, whatever, I just put it on my schedule. And I also run just one, one calendar. Um, I know a lot of people use a personal calendar and um, work calendar, but I prefer just to have one. I use um, Google Calendar, and I use a one calendar, because then I know what... I have the macro of everything. What what is you know I'm working on, and my personal time is all in there. So I, I it's much better for me to look at, and it makes things a lot simpler. And I'm all about making things simple. And my four uh, secret will be batching tasks because it allows me to focus all my attention on a specific uh, work for the day, and that is very important. Because what I notice by doing that, I am getting a lot more work. Uh, you are in a productivity flow. You are on a you work on a rotation basis. So I stop the God. I can never catch up. And I'm or you know things forgetting about things getting neglected. You know uh, things will get neglected or I forget or you know I just simply I'm too tired, drained, or don't have the time. Period. But by doing it, by, uh, by bashing my task, uh, I, I noticed I was starting to, you know, like three, I started doing it and 
in two, three weeks, I, I just noticed the change. So for example, let's say on Monday, I do all my blog writing. I, on Tuesday, I do my um, social media content and scheduling. Uh, Wednesday is my day with four clients. You know, I schedule all my uh, coaching clients on Wednesday. And Thursday, I work on my newsletter or I do Facebook Live or, or record videos. Uh, I do it on Thursday. And then Fridays, I do like financial, um, my financials, also business development. But obviously, you will work that around the nature of your business and obviously your business needs. So, but it's to give you an idea about how powerful and game changer bashing tasks can be. But if you want to take your um, productivity to a next le next level and get even more done, I will also um, recommend my fifth secret, which is seeming your weeks because that will enable you to devote on individual projects on a rotation basis, again, such as developing new sources of revenue and refining and improving existing products. For example, recently, one of my theme weeks was to improve my existing opt-in. It needed um, updating and all of that. So I dedicated one week for that. Then the following week could be working on my theme week, it will be about my sales page. And the following one could be about blog maintenance. So you always are on a rotation basis. So it's harder for you to uh, fall behind. And you also get rid of that uh, feeling of overwhelm and being overworked and also feeling like you can never catch up. So by doing those, you uh, it will help. Then, my next uh, secret, number six, is a a scheduling downtime to recharge your batteries and reconnect with your inner creativity. Um, I used to work like go, 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 go nonstop, but what I find out about, you know, with that is that either I get drained, depleted of all energy, and I even got... Um, despondent about my even my business because it's like I never have time for for you know like relax and spend time with my friend just or just read a book you know something I enjoy doing um, and one I I I, learn, I learned the lesson one time by because I got really sick and I just couldn't do anything so th that's how sick I was and so I recommend downtime. Uh, from weekend to week, I like to take my um, weekends off, obviously, at least um, go to the coast if I'm, you know, depending where I am in the world, um, I do that. But not just, you know, weekends or a one week vacation or, you know, two weeks vacation. That's not, sh shouldn't only be your downtime. Your downtime could be like sometimes like in the middle of the week, like Wednesday. I just like to go and um, go window shopping just that relaxes me I get distracted I go to a book uh, bookstore I love bookstores and read about you know look at books and everything things like that and that is taking that time that downtime um, it gets my creativity flow going again and so you know there are days where we feel oh my god it's, 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 I'm too frustrated or whatever just take take some time downtime take some time off and, and you know take a walk to the park uh, that's something I also do I have dogs so I take them for long walks and that I recharge I then I think of I could think better and all of that and then that obviously helped uh, my business and my last uh, secret will be to review the results so every six months I check what's what's working and what's not and then, you know, whatever do doesn't work, I get rid of it and keep obviously what's working and look for even, you know, look for way always to improve. And um, uh, you know, rework what is necessary that, that what needs reworking just, you know, always do that. Because again, nothing is written in stone. So you always have to be evaluating things 
in your business, what works, what doesn't work. And so review, reviewing results, you could do it every six months, once a year, every three months, whichever it will be your preference, you know, um, uh, do it. I will recommend it. So that's, um, um, that's my, um, seven, my secret to get more done in seven steps. Uh, the, if you find this helpful, uh, let me know in the comments below so I know that you are um, getting something, you know, you are benefiting from it. Also, um, what other things do you do, you know, if you, if you are doing some of these or none of these, um, but you're doing other things to do more in less time, uh, let me know in the comments. And um, don't forget, sign up for my Profitable System Blueprint because that will help you plan and, um, and schedule your workday, okay? So the link is in the, it will be below, but it's also at the top of uh, the page. And thank you so much for listening. Until next time, bye.